All right, 343 Ramrod here. Just want to <clears throat> try out a glitch that I saw on YouTube today. And uh, this is on the Xbox, actually. I, I don't know if he was using the glitch on PC or Xbox, but I'm playing it on Xbox 360 right now, so I'm going to try it out. Um, basically, the glitch is you can get underneath White Run and explore uh, the unrendered version of Skyrim, and you can also find a hidden chest. So that should be the big deal here, but pretty much uh, once you come into White Run, you head up to this path up here, and you want to make a left right there, come up this ramp, jump onto this roof, side strafe, and jump whenever you're on the roof, and you'll be able to hop your way up to those wooden beams up here. From the wooden beam, you want to jump on this dragon. Well, it's a decorative dragon. You can't really tell from this angle, but it's a decorative dragon head. And uh, you want to run and jump from the top of that dragon head to where I'm at now. So, <clears throat> this is the hard part. To get to the area where we want to get the chest, we want to jump inside of this wall. So, I'm going to try and do this in one go here. Fall through. And there we go, we made it. Now, <clears throat> we fell through the wall. And uh, pretty much we are out underneath of Whiterun right now. Now, the game thinks we're still inside of Whiterun, but it says open to Skyrim, so pretty much we're just seeing the unrendered version of Skyrim as it would if we were inside of Whiterun looking out at Skyrim, so I think that's pretty neat. <clears throat> Same thing happened in Oblivion every now and then. <clears throat> if you are able to jump over the walls of the castle, so we're going to run to this box see what's inside of it but as you can tell everything's unrendered there's not much going on <clears throat> but the box is underneath the sky forge <clears throat> here's the first farm that we see whenever we come out there's uh, no plants no people anything I I think even if you go to the doors, you can't even open them up. Yep, can't open them up. <clears throat> well, we're coming around to the Sky Forge area. And we want to head up this little hill. And up this hill. And we see the Sky Forge Eagle right there. Now, don't worry about this. You won't fall down if you go in here, but you want to stay close to this wall. You want to walk towards this rock and over to the left, and you should bounce up here. Once you get up here, you want to walk into this crack right here, and you'll see you'll go through the rock. Now, continue walking. Yep, there's our chest. <clears throat> and, um... You may hit an invisible wall over here. That's okay. You just walk to the left until you can move towards the chest. So let's. You have to jump and uh, press A to get to it. So. All right. Looks like we've got all kinds of different armor and weapons. We've got some ebony ingots. It's good. We got some gold. That's always fun. There's a lot of different stuff in here. Uh, you got your you got your wolf armor in here as well if you haven't already gotten it from the companions guild so that's a different that's a different little Easter egg that wanted to see if it worked on 360 and it does so that's pretty neat and uh, pretty much we're gonna try and get back into the world so you want to walk towards the stairs. You can see them already coming into view as we walk closer. And, uh, we're back into the world. There's my follower, and she's very happy to see me. Alrighty. But, that video is for you guys, just to check anything out. So, just wanted to see if it would work on 360, and it does. So, <clears throat> I think it's a pretty cool... Uh, a little Easter egg that I, they haven't fixed yet, but 
I'm going to use Firestorm here. It's the Master Destruction skill. I really like this spell. It is uh, pretty insane. It is pretty insane. I don't know why we're hurting each other. Let me cast this spell, you jerk. Everyone dies. Okay. Well, that's that. But thanks for watching, and uh, keep playing Skyrim. You're already